all right guys welcome back to the another video i am take chetri in this video i am going to show you how to create the node packages so so that you can install the package using npm install and then the package name so let's get start all right so before diving into the coding section i want to list out some free request so first thing is you need to install the node.js uh, for me i'm in windows so i install 64 bit and then and the thing is you need the code editor uh, for me i have the visual studio code editor uh, which is here i'm opening currently and uh, you also need the code editor and uh, for me i'm going to write the package name is console printer which is simply the package for uh, printing the console log messages based on a user past parameter so for the simplicity i'm simply writing it uh, the simple package so to do so first thing is you need to uh, initialize your npm so just write npm init and after that you need to write your package name for me it will be console uh, printer and then a version will be you can specify the version number but for me i want to give the version number a 0.0.1 .0 since it's the first version and then uh, is the description print the cons console message and then entry point to index.js and then we don't have text command and right now i don't have git repository and keywords uh, you can specify any keywords but for me it's okay and author name is of course my name so i am texan and license is by default it will be isc but you can define other license as well so it looks okay so i click yes and then now you can get the package.json file all right so after that uh, i need to create the index.js file index.js file inside which i can write my actual function so so my function name will be console printer and then it will take the uh, one argument called print uh, value and then i simply write console.log and then uh, print value and after that you simply need to like export this function so i can export it with export default since i have only one uh, function so i'm writing export default console printer and if you have multiple functions so you you may need to write export uh, some function and right now i can save this so whenever we like call this function with some value then it will console log that particular value now you need to log in to the npm so for that you need to write npm and then log in and then you might need to add your username and then password and then uh, you might need your email also one more thing if you have uh, added the multi-factor authentication to your account you might need to check the uh, one-time passwords in your email address as well so right now i am currently logged in as i am texan in my account so the next thing is you need to publish this package to publish it you can simply write npm publish and then uh, you need to write it says public now you notice that uh, the package is uh, currently published to the npm so if i go to my package manager and then i search for my package so copy and then search it here 
so you will get the exact package over here so right now my package is published and then it has the current version of 0.0.1 .0 and if you want to add the readme then simply uh, add readme file readme.md file over here uh, so that you can write your documentation over here and then you can um, so that the same thing will be written over here and then if you want to like change the version of package that means you want to update your package then you can simply modify this code and then don't forget to change the version number over here and then after that you need to npm publish again so that you will publish the second release of this package all right to use this package so simply you need to write npm install console printer maybe i can paste it here and then uh, it will be installed in your uh, node module so that uh, you can simply use it uh, by simply importing it or in your own way simply if you want to publish your package is a leaflet plugin then uh, simply i want to show you one example over here uh, so that you can follow the same method to publish your package for the pl leaflet plugin you need to add your example section and then you need to add your all the source code inside src folder and then uh, you need to have the readme.md file these are the mandatory things and uh, here in the plugin section actually if you check the develop your own section so it's on the below so you can uh, add the like you can see the requirements over here and then plugin guideline is listed here so how you can write the things and uh, these things i am going to explain uh, in my repository so uh, in my this leaflet geo server request plugin so i have the package.json file in which i added all the dev dependencies and all the keywords and also the repository url and inside the source folder uh, it's similar to index.js file in the previous section so i have extended my feature group class uh, using l.geo server so here i added a few things so first thing is i added the initialize method which takes the parameter as base layer name and options and then other things other functions are like wms wfs and few things uh, legend and wms image these are my methods inside yal.geo server and at the end you you should uh, write it in the similar manner right, uh, like yal.geoserver.wms if it's wms then you need to return your request to the wms uh, method and then wfs and legend and wms image so similarly you need to like export your functions and uh, after that you need to publish your package and uh, the other thing is like to uh, send it to the leaflet then you need to like uh, go to the leaflet repository and then you might need to fork this repository but what i simply do is i simply go to the docs section and then inside plugin section make sure your plugin is categorized based on these categories and inside which uh, you can add your own plugin so for me uh, my plugin is listed inside framework build system so inside here you can simply write your plugin name in the same way and then write your uh, write the things like this so for me uh, simply i what i will do is i'll click on the edit button after writing these things you need to ch save change and then you need to submit the pull request to the leaflet after that uh, they will simply accept your pull request if it meet the requirement for me uh, let's say uh, inside close 
if I search my package so it's uh, added I think two or three years ago and then we have a few communications and after that I it, resolve the comments and finally it get merged and then if you see the leaflet uh, leaflet js official website so you will see my package under plugins and then frameworks and then uh, leaflet geo server request over here so you can see the package right here and then a uh, small description and demo and then my username so that's how you publish your uh, leaflet plugin i hope this video is helpful for you so i'll see you in the next thank you for watching